go, maybe see some comedy. Yes. That's right. She opens for Andrew Dice Clay. And let me tell you, very, very funny woman. Eleanor Kerrigan joins us in the studio. And they are at the Laugh Factory at the Tropicana all weekend tonight until Sunday. Welcome. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much for having me. Well, I was excited to have you uh, because I've been to the show before <laughs> uh, years ago at the Hard Rock. And I was saying you were just, uh, you had me dying. Oh, You're thank so, you. so funny. And, I like uh, that you remembered my tight jeans bit. <laughs> And that's very important. I said, I remember your tight jeans, and she thought that was really, really funny. Yeah, These your tight are very jeans important funny. bits that I do <laughs> about tight jeans. I love it. And, and vegans, I pick on vegans. Oh, you know, yeah. there's everything, yes. You do a little bit of everything. I do pick on a lot of people, and I apologize in advance. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Well, I love it. But it's fun. <laughs> I love it. I love opening for Dice. The Tropicana is so much fun. The Laugh Factory is one of the best clubs. The, sh the shows have been so packed mm -hmm. and it's just been such a different energy. I don't know if it's because people need to laugh more. Probably. Or what. We like there's so much Political nonsense stuff. going on. You want to get away from Facebook. You want to get away from Twitter. Mm -hmm. Come to the show. You will love it. Yeah. It we have we talk about everything. <laughs> I can only imagine. Yes, you guys do. I've seen one of your shows before. Yes. And you've been um, with Clay opening for him for what you were saying, like eight years? I've been uh, opening for him for eight years. I've been doing stand-up ten years. This month is ten years for mm -hmm. me. So I'm like, you know, getting yeah. my ten year in. Yeah. And uh, yeah, in the beginning when I went out with Dice, when I went to open for him, I shouldn't mm -hmm. say went out with him. That's no. another story. <laughs> Which uh, we're going to get into in a minute. Yes. But when I went out on the road with him, they, I, I got booed off the stage. I wasn't ready. Because uh -huh. the Dice fans, the Dice crowds, mm. they don't, if you're not ready, they will let you know. Wow. And they did. And I appreciate it, guys. Yeah. Uh, but because I'm back. Because you're on point now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, so you said you used to date Andrew uh, Dice Yeah, Clay. I was engaged. Engaged. Yeah. And now you work together. And now you're friends with his he's, wife. And what happened? And where did my, you meet? Dice is my second ex-fiance. Okay. I'm not a closer, guys. <laughs> uh, <laughs> So I'm, not, I'm just not good at that, whatever. But he's my second ex-fiance. He gets so mad when I say that, so I hope he's watching. And um, yes, we met at the comedy store. I was a waitress at the mm -hmm. comedy store when I moved to LA. And then I met Dice. And we stayed really good friends even after we broke up. Like, I always say we broke up because I regained consciousness. <laughs> but uh, that's kind of tough, huh? Well, people got nervous. <laughs> it's a joke. We joke about it. But uh, his wife and I are really tight as well, really close friends. In fact, for a while, I was dating her uncle. So What? It's real weird. This is a real, this is like a whole soap opera thing going. It's a full-blown life soap it's opera. It's a family atmosphere. It's a family affair. <laughs> it <laughs> sure is. I love it. But we love it. And I'm st super Super tight with his children. Mm -hmm. Dice had full custody of his children, so I helped him raise his kids. And they have an amazing band called Still Rebel, and sometimes they travel with us too. So mm -hmm. it really is truly like a family affair. Yeah. And awesome. we have a lot of fun. I love it. And yeah. you guys are tonight until.